All right, what is going on, guys? Today we are watching Doctor Stone episode twenty-three. Uh, I have checked. Finally, I've checked this week, and um, beforehand, without saying some random number, it is the semi season finale this week. It's episode twenty-three. There are twenty-four episodes. Next week is the season finale. Holy crap! Ah, I don't want it to end, but it's you know season two. Season two will come soon, most likely. Because it's doing, it's done, it's done very well for itself. It's come very soon, hopefully. Uh, so yeah, I, I can't really remember what I know what happened in the last episode, but there's no preview to this show, so we'll talk about that in a second. But anyway, let's get right into it because I'm very excited for this episode. Yeah. Okay. For once, I don't think I have to mess with any audio or anything. Now oh, they're playing with the telescope. <laughs> Don't stare into the sun. Yeah. <laughs> Sick. Literally. It is. Yeah, it is. Yeah. I saw, uh, just by coincidence, I saw online like the other week or something like that. Well, sometime this week. The um, tungsten can re reach temperature of like 6,000 Fahrenheit or something. Or degrees, I don't know, Fahrenheit, probably. I don't know how much that is in degrees, which is what I use. So, I didn't really read what they said there, but I'm not going to go back. Uh, I've got the gist. <laughs> Mm hmm Yeah. Da 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 it's only January fourth. Ramen. <laughs> and they have them all, right? Yeah. Bana bam bam bana bam bam bana bam. All right. So in the last episode, we had the it was the magma episode, magma the person, and uh, they went into the caves. They found the oh, I can't actually remember the name of the. The material, but it turns into tungsten, which is the most resilient metal on the planet to heat, which is fucking awesome. We have lots of that now, then we can do it. So that's past us. That's another step, just you know, throw behind us. Um, so yeah, we got that, and uh, they wanted to get loads of other rare materials, but uh, Magma made a deal with Jen. You're like, oh, you need to get him back here in three days, and they're like, blah 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 blah. They got back, and it turns out it's Senku's birthday. That was fucking... It was a QS, so, like, not gonna lie. It was very wholesome. And, um, Jen's, pre Jen's pretty smart himself. Like, for figuring that out and whatnot. Like, damn. Fair play to him. We see, like, the, the revelation towards the end where Jen knew about Senku, knew how knew how amazing he was, and basically took an interest in joining the Kingdom of Science from the very beginning. And that's why I'm saying. I've been saying, these guys, they're an amazing duo, and this is only the tip of the iceberg. Like, for those two, trust me. Trust me, guys. They are amazing. You're going to love them. If you don't already. <sighs> I wonder what we're gonna, what's going to happen in this episode. Wave of Science. So, it's from this title, it sounds like the phones are going to be done. This episode. I think. In the universe. Oh, here we go. Uh, gold, glass, iron, lead, tungsten, 3,400 degrees. Yeah, okay, so 3,400 degrees and then like 6,000 Fahrenheit or something. That's cool. I'm sure um, lava, magma. What are they doing? Is that right? They're not fucking up, are they? I mean, that works. Oh, okay. <laughs> Good. You didn't fuck it up. Yeah. 
Yeah. Det er ikke noe som er Ja, ja, ja. Jeg var også tenkt at magma og lava er sånn, jeg er sikker det er like 1000 degrees eller noe sånt. Så tungsten kan just like I make a imagine making a bucket of tungsten. <laughs> just to be actual Minecraft, be like carrying lava and shit, that'd be awesome. Don't quote me on that, but I'm pretty sure that's how hot lava is. Right, 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 you're doing chemistry stuff, yeah, that's what he does. And it's done. I mean, I understand the fundamentals of what's going on, but I don't understand why yet. But he's got to explain it, so it's fine. A melt. Oh, okay. <laughs> Thought it'd explode. Ah. I'd, I'm not smart enough, but I'd say like a solder and I, but obviously that just solders, that's not meant to heat stuff up. Right? Well, just so I have no idea what's going to happen here. That'd be you. Okay. So he's giving him a challenge. He needs to figure it out for himself. He says he's got all the materials to do it already. So he's got to use his brain. I know it's Chrome. He's smart as hell. Yep, yeah, that's what I said. Uh, it's the boys. Oh, I love this part. Oh, look at him. Oh. Yeah. He doesn't have to be a warrior. He's just been doing the best he can all of his life. A maker buddy. Oh. Maker buddies. Right here. Right here. Oh. Who cares? Oh. Oh, I'm going to cry, Kaseki, stop it. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I love the relationship between everybody in the show. It's so wholesome. Kaseki is such a great character as well. He's one of the characters, just like Jen, Chrome. Like, Karko, always have great moments in the show. I love it. I mean, if you've got a good memory, which I'm sure you have because you're a mentalist, and stuff is labelled, you could probably have a good attempt to go, like, a go at it, you know. But I suppose it's a lot of things that just you don't usually listen to or don't put into sentences that maybe he doesn't understand. <laughs> hmm. I don't think the sun is going to be able to heat. The sun is going to be enough to heat these things. 
to be honest. Mm. <laughs> it's not the sunlight. Uh-huh. Hmm. Okay, we're getting there. Iron, yeah, but tungsten is like still miles away. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Tongues then toothpaste. <laughs> All of the above. <laughs> If it works, it works, you know. He's smart enough to know that it all works. Mm-hmm. Ooh, that noise. <laughs> that was just hydrogen, hydrogen with a lot of heat. Peels the rust right off the toothpaste. Damn. <laughs> That's sick. Ooh. That must be fucking so hot. Yeah. That's cool. Do we only need one? The tiny little tube. Tiny little tube. I mean, yeah, that's pretty fucking cool. What is it? Oh. <laughs> the vacuum action is off the charts. That's ridiculous. <laughs> These are the type of things that should be made by machines, right? Hmm. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Jed. He's going to build it regardless. <laughs> Yeah, literally. That's his, that's, that's his skill, talking out of his ass. <laughs> it is ridiculous. Even in our generation, something like that is takes a master to do it. Oh, this is awesome. Let's make our bodies. Oh, I love it. I absolutely love it. <laughs> Maker buddies. Doesn't matter your age. The seek I want to do more. 
Oh. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Hmm. It's just what the earth needs. The invention of plastic again. <laughs> that was a joke. Plastic is amazing. For science. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Petroleum. <laughs> yeah, exactly. You deserve this, Jen. <laughs> Boil the liquid that comes out. Oh. Pour it over some hot copper and... <laughs> mm-hmm. It's basically what chemistry is. Chemistry is all about addition. Yep, that's what... I'm a, I'm a psychic. I don't know what they're going to say. Why is everything... Senku makes always come back to like Yakuza corpses, you know, I, dissolving bodies. <laughs> Coal ash plus some sodium oxide if you want to first make plastic. Bakelite. Okay. Oh. Oh. <laughs> you have to train. Kark is going to. The village elder. No. <laughs> Are they going back to the same cave? I wonder. Ooh. Oh, even his dad, even her dad's helping him. Oh, they made a stove. No way. Oh. That's fucking cute, not gonna lie. Oh, Sengu, you suggest Sundra. <laughs> yeah. The preservation of human life. And the leveling up of it. It's a very dumb, dumbed down way of saying it, but I can't think of anything bad to say. <laughs> yeah! That's what we like to hear. It's walking away like a JoJo character. <laughs> Zinc carbon. Shoot some materials from the. Nice. You can do this, Jen. Follow the instructions. You got this. What the fuck is this? Am I going to use rice balls? Call in the middle. Wow. Wow. <laughs> Can't get my what is this little fucking... Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh, no. 
that little skit scene? What the fuck was that? That was great. Wine? Yeah, what do you need wine for? So much about science, I don't know, man. Oh, okay. Little crystals. Sugar crystals? Uh-huh. Ah. Mm. What? That's fucking awesome. What? Oh, what? Why is the intro playing? Or the first intro? What's going on? Oh, we're getting a little, like, uh, time skip montage. Oh, this is cool. <laughs> How long have they been making that? Jeez. Look at him. He did it! This is very small, very delicate for old hands. You know? Oh, she's helping. That's good. I was so confused why, why the first opening was playing. Hack. Kinro. Gomu Gomu. Confirmed. <laughs> oh, it's so nostalgic. I think this, um, I like it. I, th I love that the opening's playing. This is, uh, yeah, this is such a big level up for their science. Man, this has really taken like a year, right? Almost a year, even. This is so sick. Oh, it's so nice to hear Good Morning World again. Not as small, but there it is. Yes. Let's get it. Do they need to make two? <laughs> Whoa. Whoa, that's sick. Radio waves, that's fucking awesome. Oh shit. Oh god, those characters. Ooh. Senku's phone. Ah, <sighs> that's sick. Yeah, right, let's have a look at the ending, shall we? Let's get it. Voice over infinite distance. Voices over infinite distance. Is it infinite distance? Yeah, it basically is, isn't it? That's cool. Oh, we. My God, that episode was awesome. Oh, where do I even begin? Let's just take it from the top. Like, my God, the phone is finished. Not as big as a, not as small as, you know, you'd think a cell phone would be, obviously. But um, not as big as it could have been either. Just in time for spring, you know. I I really don't hope they don't have to make a second one. Or maybe some kind of... Instead of making a second one, they make just a receiver. So, like, they can't talk from Sukasa's end. But all they, all they do is hear. So, that'd probably take a lot less time, I suppose. Um, so, yeah. It's, whether that's going to happen next episode. The next episode being the finale once again. Like, oh, how's it going to go? Oh, I don't know. I Oh, I just need season two announcement. I need it, like, straight away, honestly. It'll kill me if I don't hear it straight away. Um, but, yeah. Oh, uh, the scene of Kaseki. So I've, I've, being a banger reader, I've been waiting for that for so long. Kaseki is such a wholesome old man. Old men in anime. Old men and women are, like, badass. They're always badass. But, like, they have, like scenes like that where you just like oh can't help just but just feel like why are you making me feel and it's just it's so great i love i love the dynamic between everyone i've spoke about this so many times but 
Kaseki, Chrome, Senku, Jen, everyone is just, they're all part of a team. They've all got their skills. No matter, no matter your age, like Seeker, no matter your age, like Kaseki, they've all play, they all play a part in Senku's village and it's just awesome. Everybody's treated as equal. Uh, yeah. I can't wait for next week's episode. It's going to be, ah, oh, the, the opening, I can't believe the opening played. That was so nice. It was so, I thought like the, it just suddenly cut, like the episode had just cut suddenly. I was like, what the, f- what is going on? Um, it'd be nice if like that opening played in the finale as well, but I doubt they will now. Um, but yeah. <sighs> anyway, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. I certainly did. And I hope you guys enjoyed this reaction. Have a nice rest of your day and peace out. <laughs>